हेलो किड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी फिफ्थ क्लास ईवीएस फोर्थ लेसन न्यूट्रिशियस फूड क्वेश्चन आंसर्स पेज नंबर फोर्टी सिक्स फर्स्ट वन कॉन्सेप्शल अंडरस्टैंडिंग एबिट व्हाट इज मीन बाय न्यूट्रिशियस फूड व्हाई शुड वी टेक न्यूट्रिशियस फूड आंसर द फूड दैट गिव्स अस एनर्जी इज कॉल्ड एज न्यूट्रिशियस फूड nutritious food is of three kinds energy giving food growth food food that gives us prediction that is predictive food nutritious food is the food that consists of nutrients like carbohydrates proteins fats vitamins and minerals we should take nutritious food to get energy to do work to grow and to be healthy in our daily life finally the intake of foods helps us to gain energy to grow and work and also to be healthy okay this is the first answer next we'll see be bit write two examples for each of the foods that give us energy health and help in the growth of the body answer first point food containing carbohydrates and fats namely rice wheat jowa and millets fats like butter ghee oils etc second point foods that help us to grow or growth foods foods containing vitamins namely fruits vegetables leafy vegetables milk eggs etc third point foods which give health food containing minerals and salts namely fruit juices ground nuts fruits common salt leafy vegetables and vegetables see what is the difference between carbohydrates and proteins okay for this you divide the page into two parts and draw this tabular form okay carbohydrates proteins first point carbohydrates are the components of carbon hydrogen and oxygen under proteins first point proteins are the components of carbon hydrogen oxygen and nitrogen with sulfur and phosphorus second point they are energy giving foods under carbohydrates you write down next proteins they are body building foods next third point examples of carbohydrates maize rice wheat etc proteins examples milk pulses meat eggs fish etc okay these three points you write down differences between carbohydrates and proteins okay next one debit why should we avoid eating junk food answer first point junk food should not be eaten as it has very little nutritional value and we get very less amounts of required nutrients for a body they contain carbohydrates calories oils sugar that make us fat third point they are prepared under unhygienic conditions next fourth point they are cooked in same oil which has been used several times before fifth point artificial colors and chemical preservatives are used to make junk food attractive and to store for long periods okay these are the five points you have to write okay we'll see next one next second questioning and hypothesis a raju's mother prepared vadas with bajra that is sajjalu raju wanted to know about bajra what questions do you think he asked his 
mother answer raju might have asked his mother the following questions first one mommy i have seen sajalu in vendor's shop but could you prepare such tasty vadas second one it seems that you have soaked the millets in water 5 hours and before can't we convert dry millets into dough why should they be soaked in water third one what are the other ingredients used to prepare vadas fourth one which oil is used to fry the vadas okay i've written few questions that raju might have asked you can add some more questions of your own okay try to write on write your own answer next question kiran is lean thin and weak he does not participate actively in games and studies he falls ill very often why does this happen answer kiran is very lean thin and weak weak means tired he does not participate actively in games and studies he falls ill very often because this his body is not having the required nutrients okay next one communication through mapping skills drawing pictures and making morals a bit draw the diagrams of the food items from which we get proteins carbohydrates and mineral salts i'm giving the pictures you try to draw on yourself okay first i've given carbohydrates these starchy foods give us energy and warm next protein fruit vitamins and mineral rich food okay i have given the figures you try to draw on your own okay and remember nicely next vitamins is you can see the picture and draw it okay next b bit draw a food pyramid okay this is already in your textbook you see it in your textbook and uh, try to draw itself i am giving the figure also okay you can see the food pyramid here hmm how it is you try to draw on your own okay next one sixth appreciation values and creating awareness towards biodiversity a Nilima went to the bakery with her uncle. He said that she could buy a burger or a pizza or a curry puff. But Nilima said that they were not good for health and she did not want them. Appreciating Nilima. Okay? So you can write this answer on your own but uh, here I'm giving a answer. Nilima is a good girl. she know very well about junk foods she is avoiding food which is not good for health okay you can write it on your own also yeah but i have given uh, for some example okay for your understanding i have given some answer try to add more lines or different okay different points okay next one be bit why should we preserve or protect all types of millets answer we should preserve or protect all types of cereals and millets because the food prepared from them gives us necessary nutrients second point they contain large amount of carbohydrates and less amount of proteins vitamins minerals etc third point carbohydrates and proteins in them gives us energy that is required for our body to grow and to play okay by this we complete this lesson in next video we'll see the next lesson till then bye kids have a nice day